This might be a familiar scene in your family. Oh shoot, it's past seven. I was supposed to meet my lab partner this morning. Time to turn in the comprehension questions that were due today. Wait, Owen, those are due today? You were supposed to meet me for tutoring after school today. Really? Yeah. Hey, what are you doing? You're supposed to help us with the project. Since when? Looks like this kid could use some time management skills. Can yours? In high school, kids are taking charge of their own time, and by now they should be developing time management strategies that will serve them far beyond graduation. First, kids need to find a strategy that will help them keep track of everything they have to do. The teacher always says to like take a picture of the of like the board or like write it, but I keep on forgetting. What do you guys do? Well, I think it really depends on what kind of learner you are. Like if you're a visual learner, it's great to take a picture because then it's right there and you can just glance back at it. Mm -hmm. But for me, it's sometimes also beneficial to write stuff down because then you're actually like, it's processing into your brain. For me, I like write things in my plan and if it's not checkmarked, that means, oh, I might be in process or I'll be like needing to work on it. Then they have to have some way of prioritizing things. A struggle I had was I would think, oh, I have to get this all done today. But you can always spread out your time based on what you're good at and what you're bad at. Don't save the hard stuff for later because it's just going to stress you out more. They need to look forward to tomorrow, next week, and the long term. Each kid will have their own set of things they have to juggle. And they got to be able to readjust when things change. So what can you do to help your child manage his time? Well, they can ask their child what strategies they're using and support them with that strategy. If the strategy is not working that they're using, they can suggest other strategies to use. Of course, the one that might be right for the parent may not be right for the child. Because ultimately, we want to take this kid and help him become this kid. Hey, do you want to work on our project together? Uh, give me a second. I need to check my calendar really quick. Okay. Oh, so it looks like I have to meet with Miss M to go over a problem, so can I get back to you in like 15 minutes? Yeah, sure. Okay. So remember, high schoolers with good time management skills have strategies they use to manage all the things they have to do, like a planner or an app, know how to prioritize their time, today, tomorrow, and long term, and can readjust their schedule as things change.